Channel Maker is WT Vision's system for playout automation. It is a master control room solution that drives a broad range of video servers, graphic engines, routers and switches to play out a full 24-hour broadcast or a streaming channel. Channel Maker can be configured in a box, integrated with WT Vision's media server and real-time 3D rendering engine for a complete ready-to-air broadcasting solution. It can also be used as a part of a multi-system workflow, controlling a variety of different vendors' equipment as the central sequencer and playout engine. We will discuss these workflows in a separate video. Channel Maker Sequencer is the front-end graphical user interface that allows you to sequence videos, commercial breaks, secondary events for graphics insertions, and control going to live and back. It displays the rundown both in a vertical list as well as a horizontal timeline. You can import this rundown from an upstream traffic system or just create it inside Channel Maker by dragging and dropping items from the available media window. In addition to the primary list of videos, Sequencer controls all graphic insertions through secondary events. You can add a secondary event, let's say a graphic insertion, by dragging the template from the available graphics directly into the timeline and adjusting its in and out points. Graphics like You Are Watching, Now Next, or Program Guide can be fully automated. Channel Maker is semantically aware of the content it plays out and can be configured to fetch the program's title or other metadata that has been fed through the traffic system or directly through MAM integrations. Channel Maker also lets you drive any graphic manually and take it to air whenever you need. You can call up a graphic template, fill in the form with the required information, and take it to air without having to schedule it in the rundown. Channel Maker Sequencer provides continuous feedback on the rundown, identifying and reporting on several key issues it may have. Missing media, overlaps or gaps, health checks on external equipment, media checks on the actual media, and validity of virtual in and out points are examples of such checks. Custom project rules you may have for your channel. For example, not playing out a liquor ad before 10 p.m. can also be added to the project layer. It also keeps tabs on how long you have until important operator-driven events. Countdowns identify time to next error, time to next live, time until the end of the rundown. Also, you can pick an item from the timeline that is relevant to you and get a custom timer to that. Channel Maker Playout is the subsystem that actually drives the media server and graphic engine and can be ganged in multiple redundant configurations, such as 1 plus 1 or N plus M, more typical in a playout center. If you want to know more about full Channel Maker workflows, check out this video. WT Vision's media server is fully integrated with Channel Maker and provides SDI or IP in both baseband and compressed formats, including H.264, H.265, SMPTE, 2022-6, 2022-7, 2122-8, 2110, and others. It takes up a single rack unit and can also be fully virtualized. It can also be driven entirely in the public cloud as a full channel, as a part of an existing channel's redundancy, or as a disaster recovery system. Stay tuned for more tutorials about WT Vision's Channel Maker. Thanks for watching!